Next up, we are, again, almost done with the second round, so this is great. Representing Watershed High School, this is Gwendolyn Austin. Domestic Violence by Yvonne Boland. It was winter, lunar, wet. At dusk, pewter seedlings became moonlit orphans. Pleased to meet you. Meet to please you, said the butcher's sign in the window in the village. Everything changed the year that we got married. And after that, we moved out to the suburbs. Oh, Young we were, how ignorant, how ready to think the only history was our own. And there was a couple who quarreled into the night, their voices high, sharp. Nothing is ever entirely right in the lives of those who love each other. In that season, suddenly, our island broke out its old sores for all to see. We saw them too. We stood there wondering how the salt horizons and the Dublin hills, the rivers, table mountains, Viking marshes, we thought we knew had been made to shiver into our ancient 12 by 15 television, which gave them back as gray and grayer tears, and killings, 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 then moonlit colored funerals. Nothing we said. Not then, not later. Fathomed what it is, is wrong in the lives of those who hate each other. And if the providence of memory is only that, remember, not a tongue. And if I can be safe in the weak spring light in that kitchen, why is there another kitchen? Spring light always darkening in it, and a woman whispering to a man over and over. What else could we have done? We failed our moment, or our moment failed us. The times were grand in size and we were small. Why do I write that? When I don't believe it. We lived our lives. We're happy. Stayed as one. Children were born and raised here. And they're gone, including ours. As for that couple, did we ever find out who they were? And did we want to? I think we know. I think we always knew. <laughs>